Hi everyone, um, welcome to today's tutorial sheet. I mean, tutorial video. Uh, we're solving question seven from tutorial sheet four. So the question is saying the expression two x cubed minus x squared plus a x plus b gives the remainder of fourteen when divided by x minus two and rem the remainder of negative eighty six when divided by x plus 3 find the values of a and b so this question is not very much different from question 6 and uh, hence the way I'm going to solve it is similar to the way I solved question 6 so here when you read the question it's telling us to say whenever you divide uh, this uh, function whenever you divide this function by uh, x minus 2 you get the remainder 14 so what this simply means, sorry for that, what this simply means is that what this simply means is that when you find f of, um, let's take for instance we say x, we equate this x, we equate this x, x uh, minus 2 to 0, when you equate this to 0 you are going to get the value of x to be equal to uh, 2. So these two, when you find f of 2 use in this um, function, you discover to say, the, I mean, you have to equate it to 14 since uh, the remainder is 14. So when we say 2, and then while this x, we put 2 to the power 3 minus, then we have while this x, we put 2 there to the power 2, then we have plus a, this is a, and then there we put 2, and then plus b, like that. Then we say this should give us uh, the remainder, what, 14. So this is 14. So this is basically what I'm trying to talk about here. So once you do that, you also you you now just have to simplify the expression that you have been given. Now how do you do the simplification? Okay. So now uh when you multiply, I mean when you raise this 2 to the power 3, you get the answer to be 8. 8 times 2, you get 16. So this is what you are going to get. Here you get 16, then 2 squared, you get 4, and then this will just be 2 times a, which will give you 2 a, and then that b is this b here. So when you subtract this 16 minus 4, you get 12. When you take 12 to the other side of the equal sign, this side you remain with 2 a, and then you have plus uh, b, being equal to this will be 12 minus 14 i mean 14 minus 12 which is just 2 so this is just going to be your equation one so you also do the same on the second part there when you divide i mean sorry yeah when you divide it by this it gives the remainder negative 86 so what you do is you find f of negative 3 you say you say let x be equal, I mean x plus 3 be equal to 0. So meaning the value of x will just be equal to negative 3. So here you find f of negative 3, meaning you are going to have 2 ra times negative 3 there raised to power 3, then minus negative 3 raised to power 2. Then you are going to have a negative 3 there then plus b this one should give you negative 86 from there you're going to have 3 raised to power 3 is just nothing but uh, 27 so now since the 3 is negative it's going to be negative 27 times 2 so negative 27 times 2 you get 54 so this will give you negative 54 and then this one will give you negative uh, 9 and then here you get negative 3a 
and then plus b this is just equal to negative 86 so here it's just a matter of simplifying the expressions now so let me just simplify them on top there so when i simplify this i'm going to have something like this so this negative uh, 9 and negative 54 when you add those you get 63 negative 63 so when negative 63 closes crosses the equal sign there you have um this that that's 86 and then plus negative 86 plus uh 63 you get negative 23 so in other words we're going to have negative 3a this side plus b being equal to negative 23 so here's just a matter of uh, solving this is equation 2 you solve uh, equation 1 and equation 2 simultaneously so from equation 1 which is this one you can make b the subject of the formula so b is equal to uh, 2 minus 2a so you replace b into that equation you're going to have negative 3b uh, plus 2 minus oh sorry negative 3a not 3b this is a let me just do this negative 3b minus 2 i mean plus 2 minus uh 2 sorry i'm repeating the same thing negative 3a supposed to be negative 3a i'm getting this one here so negative 3a plus 2 minus 2a 2 minus 2a is just equal to negative 20 Three. So when you take this ne t positive 2 to the other side of the equal sign, you are going to have um, this side you have uh, negative 23 minus 2. And then this side you remain with negative 3a minus 2a, which gives negative 5a. And then this side, so here we have negative 5a. And then this side you have negative 25 so when you divide by negative 5 divide by negative 5 there you get your a to be equal to uh, 5 then having found your a you, you can now find your b so b is just equal to um, 2 minus 2 while this a we put 5 so in other words b is just equal to uh, 2 minus 10 which gives you negative 8 so you now conclude to say the value of a is just equal to 5 and then the value of b is just equal to negative 8 so this, these are basically the answers that you've been asked to find so thank you very much for watching today's tutorial. See you in the next tutorial sheet. Uh, sorry, in the next tutorial video. This is uh, question 7. Yeah, we're going to be solving question 8 in the next uh, tutorial video. So if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, kindly do so. Press on the button which says subscribe so that you don't miss out the oncoming videos that I'm going to be posting. Shalom, shalom.